So it's uh, day 14 of my Camino. It's uh, 10 minutes past six. It's July 14th. I'm now leaving uh, Leon to go somewhere else. <laughs> So it's time for my breakfast. As normally, I have the tortilla and some juice today. Actually, orange juice, so it's gonna be a great breakfast. So I'm with Kelly. Yes. And we are jogging a little. We're catching Maria Paula, who's up ahead. Yeah. So Maria Paula is learning to speak English on the Camino. <laughs> She's Italian. And she's just finished her first year of teaching. So I asked her, Maria Paula, how old are you? And she says, with such confidence, I am 55. <laughs> <laughs> no, she's not that old. <laughs> and I said, come on, because she's a brand new teacher in her 20s for sure. No, I am 55. <laughs> so and then people I think we're going crazy, <laughs> by the way. <laughs> so then she starts going like this. In Italian. Oh no no 25. 25, yeah. So we're gonna catch her. So we're just going for a little run on the Camino, yeah. which is totally normal. <laughs> and you will see it when we find her again. So buen camino! Buen camino! Let's get her now. Maria Paula! <laughs> no. So uh, no, just spend some more time with uh, Kelly and also with Maria Paula. But probably the last time I see them. But then again, with the Camino, you never know. I could see them in Santiago, so we'll see. Uh, but maybe. I will see Philip today. We talked on the phone because we were both staying in Leon yesterday, but we then I didn't have his number. But uh, Maria Paolo also knew him and he had the phone number. So now we talked and uh, we're gonna try to hook up today. And he said he owes me a hug because I gave him one. So we'll see. Can be a good evening this as well. Buen Camino. So I don't know if you can see it. It's a new hat. Forgot my hat in Mancilla de la Mula. I love that hat. It was a good hat. And I forgot it together with the soap I used for my laundry. That was okay. Yesterday I just used the same laundry as I used in the shower. That worked well fine. So I'm just going to keep on doing that. So I would still have a Buen Camino!
Okay, so today I'm actually gonna stay in an alberga with bunk beds, sharing room with others, and all just to be able to see Philip again. And uh, that's not all, but actually this is where Kelly and Maria Paolo also are staying. I thought I wouldn't see them again. But anyway, it's not a single room. This one is mine, so. Yeah, if I don't manage to sleep and uh, too much snoring, I just start walking early, so that's positive anyway. Okay, so with the alberga, uh, they do give you these like uh, paper linens, so it's kind of clean and sanitary. But I know, I know we're gonna sleep bad tonight, because the mattress has this rubber thing around it. So when you lay on it, your skin doesn't breathe. I mean, you just lay there and you sweat and you sweat and you sweat. So I know we're gonna wake up like every 30 minutes. So we'll see. Maybe I just take my things and sleep outside or I just start walking early. We'll see. Single rooms in pension is so much better. And that's why it's good with a single room. Because now, I'm just sitting in a line, waiting for a shower. You don't have to do that when you have a room for yourself, but uh, I guess it's the charm of the Camino. I'm doing my laundry and listening to some music. Santiago, Santiago, and guess what? Guess what? When you don't think the day can get any better, right? Are you in a phone call? How you doing? Very good to see you. Santiago, si Dieu veut toujours droit de France, nous irons jusqu'à San Francisco.